evening to you. Welcome to Obina Show Live. We hope your day was beautiful, your week has been beautiful, and if not, don't worry, next week is still loading and we're going to get to do better. For tonight's episode, I'm hosting one of the goddesses on the decks. She's a queen on her own right. She's a mother. She's talented and she's beautiful. <laughs> she's goddamn, she's hot. <laughs> The one and only Piera McKenna. Thank you. Hey, girlfriend. Thank you. <laughs> How you doing? You look pretty good, though. I look good? Yeah. Say it again. No, you really look good. You're not very you. single right now, and I don't take compliments lightly on this. Yeah, me too. <laughs> oh, wow. Okay. Go, <laughs> <laughs> where have you been? Asante, I'm good. You're looking nice. Really? Thank you so much. Thanks for having me. In a funny way, I've not had you yet, but in a far... <laughs> <laughs> you saw what I did there, you saw? Smooth, right? I need to be meeting you more daytime. <laughs> so you can have me here. Huh? Uh -huh. <laughs> okay, yes, that one. And so I can see you like this. You know me, I only see you in this yeah. pushimi shimi lights. Like a tuja and galiana you for more than five seconds. Yeah. Like an eye for an eye. I, oh, yeah, okay. I know. I know the last time we tried to do that, it really went south. <laughs> Things were about to go down. Yeah. You know, the thing is this, when you're in a club setting and the lights are kind of kidogo doing this and that, now could you decks, na mimi ni MC wako, things are just shaky, no? You're so easy. And I'm just yes. there. <laughs> you're so easy. You know, you say that's how I play. I mean, naturally, uh, when, you know, when you're playing somehow, you, you gotta have the bounce. It's natural. Yes, you have the bounce, all right. Your reaction, my friend. I was <laughs> left by to myself. Yeah, 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 I could not do it. Me, I was like, uh, uh, you know. That explains why we can't look at each other for five seconds. Yes. And then I've also noticed something today that I've looked at you for a while. You have very white eyeballs. I think eyeballs. Like they're very white. Like most people in Akwa red, red, nini. Really? Like infection in Tanzania. Hey, hey, but your eyes are very really? white. It's, uh, maybe it's because now I've been recovering from the... The swelling that was there. I had a black eye just the other day. Hey, so. Pigwang and Gumi. That was a story on the street. It's amazing that the people man? always Who know. There? Why would someone do? Why would someone it meet someone like Piera? Come exactly. on. Exactly. No one can do that. I so I could go me? No. Obina, you know me. Okay, who has a black was... eye from, from bad dreams? Okay, Piera, I'm going to go manage it. You know, if you speak out. <laughs> It's how you'll be held. <laughs> Let me tell you something. What happened? Let me tell you something. Yeah? One, if I got beat, me would not be quiet. I would. Yani mina zonge, vibaya sana. I would go to the streets. I'd be, you know, pekiangu kwa barabara demonstrating. I did not get beat. Okay. Okay. Secondly, if I did, most probably ninge kwa committee pia. Ah. Most likely. We 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 ni mumeru. Right. Yes, uni mumeru, guy. So I, d I don't take it lightly. So what happened, yeah. I just had an infection. Like I was, I was playing and then, you know, the way you place your towel somewhere and then I rubbed on my face. You know the way you dab-dab? And then I don't know what happened, but I got the... It was here, here, here and here. So I don't know what, the, what kind of infection. So I don't know if it's an aerobic fly or whatever, but it affected more in my, on my eye. Then ikafura, ikafunika, the eye closed and then the other one was big. So you can still see the black eye. Hmm? I have foundation on. <laughs> I don't I see have, no black eye. Or oh, you creative. have fields creative on top and everything. Okay, hey guys, well, oh, who dare touches Piera? Mini goes in leza. Who can we pick a Piera? Yani natafuta mutu. Nakuna mutu and a pig. I know, but you know, let me tell you something that changed about that getting bit thing. I realized I have good fans. I have real fans. I have haters, obviously, yeah. and very crazy haters. But that that experience just made me realize I have real love, like real. I had people who are calling me, people, even my fans, they look for my number and call me. Others DMing and the kind of things they were saying, I was like, eh, I think I have an army. I think I have an army. Same, uh, exactly. Exactly. Like, See? <laughs> <laughs> no, nope, no, it doesn't happen like that. Uh, most men who beat women are weak men. Yes, true. I agree. Uh, okay. That is true what I've said. Mm. However, let me paraphrase the whole thing. 99% of men mm. can beat women black and blue yeah. if they decide to. Yeah, yeah, yeah. However, there is 60% 
of men who are mature enough mm. to know mm. that as a man, you should never lay a hand on a woman. Totally agree. And there is 20% of women mm. who know as a, as a woman, mm. you should not provoke I was about to say the that. man for him to get beyond. Mm. Personally, mm. I've gotten to moments where nimefikiwa hapa na mwanamke akanambia kama ni mwanaume fanya chenye unaweza fanya. Pierre, I go to the gym and I do kickboxing. And I look at you I'm just like okay. But I chose to pocket, not once, not twice mm. and keep quiet. Mm. Take all the nya, 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 all the you'll be told everything as you a just man. Just walk away. Pocket, you can walk away because the door has been locked and they're standing at the door. And now if you hold them and move them away from the is door, that, that is the beginning. Yeah. So if you're smart enough, you keep quiet and you sit down and take everything for an hour or two until they get tired. But the time you leave that door, you don't come back for one week. And you'll do it again because definitely it'll happen again and again. So there's 20% of women who know not to provoke. But there's 80% who don't know because they always say, Mimi ndakupasha kama we mwana ndakupasha. But you don't know that there's this... 40% of yeah. men who ukiwa pasha, hmm. they will lash out. They will, yeah. And when they lash out, the results are very bad because now people come and say, how dare you? But you don't know what, because m what I always tell men, you hmm. don't know what. Yeah. But let me ask you, if I throw that back to you, I mean, if you come back after a week, yeah. after you've gotten that pressure, you know, you just. You have to release. Yeah. yeah. You, you swept it under the carpet and came down, yeah. came back, and then it happens again yeah. and again. Are you not going to get into a, a place where you're like, you know what? It gets. I'm done. It gets. And then now you, you it react. Gets. There are men who, when it gets to that point, because men, you know, they bottle up their emotions. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So I'll go, I'll not release it because not mm. all men talk. Ndatoka naenda kwa beshi tangu wa mananda sema tu akidogo mazee wacha ni chill chill ama nini ama I'll go to Airbnb ama wherever but men don't have this kikaos bro mazee nime toka wanyuma mama meni tukana mazee mena mea mini useless mazee mzee kwa me bro mazee chill the way women talk men don't he'll go to a bar watch football drink get drunk probably he'll come back in the morning drunk or a few days later but wherever from but hata kwa meisema it's there it piles so one day he will lash out you will shove the lady she'll hit her head God forbid she dies. God forbid. You've killed. You go to prison. Your children suffer because of this. Just this moment. Or you slap her. Yeah. Black eye. The public. Nini courts. Police. Nini mm. nini. Still, the children will go with their yeah. mother. You are the bad one. Or the man will kill himself. Because mm. do you know that the highest rate of suicide in Kenya is for men? Yeah. It's about 314. About 77 only are women. The rest are men. Research has proven why do men commit suicide? Mm -hmm. Because nobody's listening. But the only few percent of women who know will not provoke. Mm. But also we have a few percent of men, the 40 percent, who don't know how to suck it in, mm. who don't know how to walk away, who don't know how to keep quiet, they will lash out. And now they give men a bad public image. Because wana ume kaziao, men are abusive, men are this, yeah. men are this, men are this. But the majority know. Mm. The majority are CEOs, directors, whatever. These men, you see, even the politicians, mm. I sit down with them. Mm. There are stories we make after they've seen me sharing. They tell me the things they are going through in their house mm. with their wives, my friend. But same, women. Yeah. There are women out here who are boss ladies. Mm -hmm. But the toxic men that they have in their houses? Also. Like you sit down, like you sit, in, oh, I made a joke of, Kuna mutu anaiza piga piera. Now, there are those, see them, boss ladies, CEOs, mm. ladies who accomplish, learned and everything. But they're stuck with a few men because of cultural beliefs. Yeah. What will society say? Yeah. Let me stay for my children. Let me do whatever. But the men are very abusive and toxic. Because if they come out and talk about us, they say, surely, Pierre, Ooh, you Kama have. Pierre, I'm a pig, surely. Na mimi? Yeah. Mimi ni nani? Yeah. So there's that. So I always, myself, I'm an advocate for to, uh, to stop uh, gender-based violence of any form yeah. towards the I women and towards the men. I agree. And I always say, if it gets to a point for kutukanana, mm. kushautiana, mm. leave. For both sides. Leave. For both sides. Both sides. Yeah. Ushauti wana dem, ushauti wana chali, mm. leave. Just walk away. And then, most of the time, you will decide and say you will stay for the children. I did it. Trust me, it doesn't end well. And I know many other people who stayed for the children, either mm. the woman or the man. Mm. It doesn't end well. The sooner you leave, mm. the better. Mm. Because even if you don't leave for the other person, mm. leave for you. 
they might kill you or you might kill them. It's Either hurt. way. But let me ask, was it the same 20, 30 years ago during our parents' yes. era? Yes, it was. I mean, was. our parents used to take a lot. It was. No? The problem was this. During our parents' time, people were not vocal about it. Mm. Most of us, even the people watching this, once upon a time, if you are a millennial, Gen mm. Z, maybe not so much. Mm. Most millennials, you probably at some point had your mother being beaten by your father. Mm -hmm. Or at any point, you saw your mother or your mothers gang up and beat up your father. Mm. And it was thought something normal. And they, they would sit down in a baraza. And your mother would toroka kwenda kwao. Na tamiwa na zazake rudi kwako. Na rudishwe. Ama rudishwe. Ama babako atarudi kwao. Kusema ni mekuja kuma msama. Hmm. Nilikuwa nimefanya dena atamuga rudi ungoje boma. Hmm. So that was back in the day. Nowadays we are saying, if you are slapped once, my sister leave. Because it will happen again. Hmm. Back in the day, you are beaten. Nakambia, umepiga otuma na moja. Mi babako na nipiga gila siku na. Asi wakupiga siyo mapenzi. So back in the day, it was different. Mm. And now it's going to be different for even our children. Because now, us at least we are talking about it, we know it is bad. Yeah. If they do, our children. And at least his voice is a wrap. I, 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 I pity our kids, though. Yeah. I, I get worried every time when I look at them. Because where we are at right now, Sisi Wenyewe, it's crazy. There are things I cannot stand. Probably you'll be like, why are you not married? But I know there are things I don't want to face. There are things I... I need to be in a very good place for me to, to I, I tell people I don't believe in divorce, for example. Oh, wow. I, do, I don't. Oh. I am one of these people who believe if I get married to somebody, we are in need. Till death do us part. Yes. And I believe in that. That's why you'll never see me make a decision to jump into marriage with just anybody because I want to please the society. And then to, two years down the road, I'm, I'm giving up, you know, because I'm like, no. This is not what I thought. Yeah. But now where we are at, kidogo mtu anasema hivyo like I'm gone. Me being like that, me relationships kidogo like this, and then I see something, like a red flag like this, I'm gone. You're out. I, I fear. I hate sleepless nights. I hate, uh, you know, thinking of what is the person I'm sleeping next to thinking about me. He's not talking to me today. Why? Eh. Are you a possessive uh, partner? Uh, I might say yes. One, because, one. It's, okay. it's a very, uh, first, I'm, I'm a very scared person. Okay. Yeah? Like, if, I, if I'm living with somebody, you're not going to leave me alone in the house. <laughs> I get scared, not because I love you and I want to spend time with you. <laughs> okay. I just, I'm just scared. Like, I, I want to be with people in the house. Okay. So, probably, I might be very comfortable if I have kids and maybe uh, employees and whatever. Most probably you go your honeys and I'll be okay You're like with me, it. I'm never alone in the house. I, me, I'm always with people. Are you serious? Ever. Yeah, Since I, I started scared. living in my house, I'm always with people. Yeah. Nikuwa peke yangu al function in the bedroom na outdoor. Kwa bedroom hivi kani mefunga melango zote mbaka ya bedroom. Na lala side moja ya bed, nikitoka asubui. <laughs> then I'll never be in the house. But kuchiru yeah. kwa nyumba peke yangu. Uh. Unasikia kwa melango, anafanya kwenye. Niko. Uh. <laughs> Alafu sasa, um, you're in a big house, you're going downstairs, you're going upstairs, nani? Yep. Apana. Imagine, no? So, okay. I want my man you to be with me around. most of the time. And if not, I, I mean, if I, if I have employees, I have kids, where okay. end I should I mean, oh, imagine well, I'm, not, I'm actually busy. not possessive. Are you I, I, I'm this kind of, um, kind of, I would feel, I, I would feel, I would not be okay with my man if he cheated and if he went with somebody. Not cheating. If I would not. If he flirted with someone else. About somebody else. If I'm there. As and long as he's like not this. disrespecting me. Here I'm a rainbow. And I'm telling. No, that one I might be go like, oh yeah, especially if I think she's hot as well. <laughs> I'll be like, I'll be like, oh yeah, she's cute. But for example, we are sit, we are here, and you're like, hey, Nani's boobs are cool. I'll be like. Okay. Oh, cheers, wow. to, cheers to them. The people like, who do, do not. That. Yes. Oh, shoot. Yes. Like, okay. for me, do not disrespect me. Let me tell you something. No, but that, I that's in. disrespect. Can I give you something you? I believe in? Okay. I believe. But I'm going to say, say it. it. There are two types of men. Okay. All right? We have dogs and we have pigs. Woof, okay. Woof. I'm just classifying them. Okay. I love dogs. Okay. Men are dogs. I love dogs. You know why? A dog is going to cheat on you, he's going to do whatever, he's going to do things, but will never disrespect you. Most likely, he'll go to Bahamas, get some chick there, you know, whatever, protect himself. He's a man, you know, that's life. And he'll come back, and he'll still never leave you, he'll have a good life, you'll be okay. He doesn't disrespect you. A pig, on the other hand, will be here, 
running after my peer, running after my cousin, <laughs> running after this. That's a big. Una ukwapa too. He's calling Mamono this other one. Pia, <laughs> but no, that is the good thing. That's the only way you'll protect yourself from bad men, pigs. Have people. Have hot. Have you seen the mamas that surround me? Hot mamas. It's the only way you'll know if your man is a pig or not. Okay. If you only have chicks who are not hot, which I don't believe there's any chick, like someone, you know, whatever. Men will never hit on anybody else. They'll just be looking at you. And the day they never meet hot mamas, they will go for them. But if you surround yourself with hot, beautiful women, let a man come. If he gets confused, Drew is not the one. But if he's appreciating them and he's still with you, then it's good to keep. Okay. So I, I, I want a dog, not a pig. Okay. Yeah. Are you a wifely woman? Am I you for the streets? I'm a wife. And like, can you bedroom. submit huh? to a man? Do you believe in the hierarchy? Yes. In the, the Bible that hierarchy where do. there's Jesus, the head of the church, then the man is the head of the house, then the woman? Let me tell you, I believe in that so bad. Yeah. Like, so bad, I wouldn't want... Basically, if we're in the house with the man and somebody hits the, hits, hits the gates, let the man go. Okay. I so much believe in a man, so much, that I wouldn't want him to ask me something. Like, what do you think we should do? I'm like, no, 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 that is you. <laughs> do it. Make the decision, you decide. Can like, you cook, though? Yeah, oh, please. What do you want I'm me just to asking, come on. Oh. I'm, I'm a very good okay. cook. <laughs> <laughs> I'm a very good cook. Yeah. One thing for sure, I don't cook as often as I should be cooking, but I do cook when I have time. Like, sometimes during the week, I can okay. cook when I have time, but weekends, I'm busy. So okay. I still have um, house managers who help in that. But I do, I do cook. So so we see wa mimi na mwanaume we are equal. Apana. And I never want that. Okay. Imagine no. And I don't want to be the one to provide. I want my man to provide. Okay. You get. Not because at I, I can't marry at a, a pop or whatever. If I fall in love, it's fine. But I want that man to be. I'd rather set up my bank account for him. But I want him to make those decisions. I want the man to come and take me out for dinner. Oh, I don't you want to be the one. Set up your bank account for him. Like we share our bank account. Let him be the one paying the bills. Oh wow! Like I really want my man to be that empowered. I want my man to take me out, not me saying at him the one paying the bills. Does it make Pierre, sense? right now you are, you're forty. Two. You're forty-two. Thanks for thinking I'm forty. <laughs> okay. Pretty this might come as a compliment, but it's yeah. not. Okay. It's a reality. You mm -hmm. don't look like you're forty. If you would not have mentioned, you would not have clicked, okay. then I remember that I'd seen you, maybe 35, somewhere 45. there. However, 35, that's when I got my baby. Okay. Mm. But you don't look that part. I've said it's not a compliment, it's a reality. Mm. This is where I'm going with this. Right now you're 42. You are yet to be married. Let me put mm. it that way. Yeah. Are you still looking to be married? Are you still hoping and waiting to be married? And why have you not been married until 42? Is it because you set up the standards too high? Ama you are looking at the guys like, ah, it's a iki ni kinini, ivi nini. Ama what's the issue? Is the problem is it men? Ama it's you. Who says the age that we should be married? No, there's no age. There's no age, but right? But the public, hmm. the perception. Yeah. Ako fotitu na jawa. Ako na shida. That's true. Nas, especially from other women. Oh, okay, 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 but my madam, I agree. I forty two guy. Now you only want to shida. Nini? Yeah. So what's the situation? Shida is if I, if I look at your man, I'll go with him. But I don't want to do that. That's what my standards are. Oh, okay. So probably that's where I've set them. You know, I don't like when women criticize other women. For example, I've I've had on my comments actually people saying like, do maybe she's saying that because she's not married. She's in mar like women do those comments, crazy yeah. comments, and I'm like, let's not go there. Because maybe when you're writing such a dirty comment, I saw, you, I saw your man somewhere. So please, let's not go there. <laughs> you know, appreciate the fact that you're married and keep quiet. Okay. Otherwise, let's not talk about your husband. Okay. However, I do, as I said earlier, I don't want to be this person who gets married to the wrong person because I want to please the society. Okay. I am not married because I don't have that person yet. Okay. I haven't met that person I want to say, I, who you? I want to spend the rest of my life with. Okay. Honestly, I haven't met that person. Have I fallen in love before? Have I been in love? Maybe. <laughs> what is in love? Maybe I've had people I'm fond of. Like no, I, no, I want no. to spend time with Let me describe it for you. You see if it's what you've been through. Hmm. You, have you ever been with someone that you would give your life for? Someone that you would stop everything for? When they call and they ask for you, you would even cancel a gig and go see them? No. 
Okay, then you've never been in love. Ni acha job actually. No. Like I, I you'd sacrifice job, I for them. You would go like, babe, where are you? Like, I'm, I'm going for this thing. Oh, babe, can I see you? I'm going through this thing. You're like, okay, cool, I'm coming now. Going through something? Yes, perhaps I've been with people. Let me see. No, you've never been in love. If you can't recognize it, then you've never. Okay, I have you been heartbroken? Had broken. There is a disappointment and a broken, Dis two different things. I've been disappointed before. Okay. Then but had broken, I'm crying because I love a man so much. Yeah. No. But I've been, I've been in that, tell me if it's the same. I've been in that situation where I'm dating this person and I'm there wondering, is he with another person? You know, and no, I'm that's like, normal. Ah, no, what? No, that's normal. No? Wondering if they're another, fearing that they're with another fearing. person, that's love. The one for, oh my God, is, Nini, Mbaka, you're, Nini, have you called someone and they've not picked and you're like, oh shit. You haven't been in love. Yeah, then I haven't found the one. If yes. you haven't seen someone and picture the two of you together forever, you haven't been in love. Anywho, it's fine. Let's move on. So right Are now... Are we in counselling session? No, no, no. We're, we're <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm feeling, no, but like, also, I, I, I just believe, I, I believe so much in love. I want to be in love. Like, I want to be, to meet that person and just go like, I love this person. I want to see this person forever, every day of my life. You're right, it doesn't happen like that. That's high school love. I, I'm, 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 love that, I'm that R&B kind of girl, by I the know, way. I know, but That's you're, the you're talking love about love at first sight, which is no. really last. I want to meet this person. Oh, my God. No, 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 no. not that's, the first that's time. That's last. Yeah, yeah, but now it only happens when you spend time with somebody. And most of the time when you're in love, you never know until it's over, one, or you never know until things start to shake kidogo, like, wait a minute. Oh my God, I've not seen them for two days. I've not seen them for three days. Okay, this now is going to one week. Da, 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 da. But initially, you just think, oh, we are cool. I'm used to hanging out with this person. Who go to a lunch? Sour. Nee, 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 nee. Then one time you realize, oh, it's not happening. That's when you realize, oh, come mates. Most people are even in love now and they don't know they're in love. The thing is, it's a, it's a sneaky link. Yeah, it's my sneaky link. We'll just meet up. We'll, you know, nini and go. Touch and go, touch you and go. Like that. Yeah, happens. What? Did no, I? I'm trying to think. Uh -oh. Do you have a sneaky probably. link? Probably. No, I'm thinking probably maybe that one person. Yeah. There might have been, maybe, but you're not sure. Now yeah. we are here. Which is your ideal type of man? They're listening, they're watching. You are a hot thing. So most men are like, okay, she's she asking somebody, so what does she want? So let's start needing <laughs> the checkbox. So Imagine the here. first one, you have to be very God fearing. Okay. God-fearing is it. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Mm. DiCaprio. And for me, by God-fearing is you believe in that person who created us. Okay. Let's not get the deep spiritual into religion. Counts. religion. Okay. Spiritual counts, eh? Yeah. Me, it's, it's so believing be in good. So for me, let me tell you what, yeah, spiritual. Counts. Good, bad, sour. Okay. There are people who believe in good, there are those people who just believe in bad, which okay. is what I classify my belief in God. If you believe in God, then you believe in the good. Okay. Does that oh. make sense? Bad on you, Kondani. Spiritual. <laughs> but yes, I need, <laughs> spiritual. I need, I need yeah, someone yeah. who fears God. Yeah, okay. Someone who has, uh, who who recognizes God. Okay. Someone who prays. Someone who, if we are in a situation right now, will be like, yes, we know we'll sort it out, but let's bring it to God together. I okay. like people who are God fearing and they believe in that. Shakara baba shakara mugura shikidi bidibidi. Secondly. <laughs> <laughs> I'm speaking in tongues. Ah, uh, uh, what are you jokes now? The, the Bible says. Eh, the Bible says. You know what it the says Bible about says? joking about the Holy Spirit? Nah, breathe. Okay. Breathe. Now you see him is <laughs> out of the league. Ah, kuna. Ah, kuna. Secondly, uh -huh. you have to you have to be very hardworking. Okay. Okay, baro to kundani. Sign sangapi. By hardworking, I don't mean you need to have. Yeah, true. You don't need to have a lot of money. Okay. I don't have to marry a rich person. Say self-driven. Self-driven. Self but they just, yeah, work Jitume. hard. Jitume. Jitume. Yeah. That's, I like, Jitume. You love me, I know. Jitume. <laughs> no, yeah, I, I like that. Too. I was going to say yeah. I like that. Yeah, I like but that yes, too. <laughs> just, just, be, just be a hardworking person, yeah? Okay. Like, let's make money together. Let's, okay. yeah. One thing I, I thank God for is that I believe in being content. I can be in a one-bedroom house and very happy. Okay. Like, I, I don't have to have the latest Range Rover spot for me to feel like Nimefikama, the G-Wagon. Okay. Like, I'm very content at the moment. I look, I would want to have a Brabus. 
that's my dream car right Ooh. now. I want to. <laughs> but does that make me want to... That's what's up. Want to do anything possible, sleep with people and, you know, break anything just to get that car? No. No. Yeah? Okay. But I know with someone together, we can work out together and then we're like, okay, let's go buy it. We have, we, go, we get there. Okay. Yeah? But also that doesn't mean if I get a rich man, I'll say no. <laughs> someone just comes and tells oh, me. Oh, wow. Me. You oh, have to go and spoil it for the hustlers in the building. No, but it's I'm fine. saying if. If. Okay, okay. And there's the connection. And he's not coming to me because he has the money. He's coming oh. to me because he likes me for who I am. Not because he thinks, oh, this chick. That would be tricky to dog, but it's fine. He loves me. He loves me because he knows he can spoil me with his money. I don't want that. Just keep your money. Would you rather someone who will give you money because they have it, or someone will give you money because they, w they want to give it to you? You understand? Like, this person has surplus. Mm. Oh, you want what? Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Because it's there. It's yeah. not like it's from the heart. Yeah. But this person who's like, oh, you want this? Okay, and they'll work for it and give, yes. Which one would you prefer? If you have the money there lying down and you just want to be like, just lying there and you want to give me, I mean, I don't, I don't mind. I don't mind money, okay? <laughs> I want money badly, but I would not make a man go through shit to just Give me a Give life. You, money. you know, okay, okay. someone has kids, or you know, you have four kids, but I'm here asking for a G wagon. So between you paying school fees and coming to give me a we G wagon, you start thinking of, no, Don't you know worry. what? Pay the school fees, then let's work together to get a G wagon. You know yeah. what I mean? Yeah, but if you have the that. money lying down there and you feel like you want to get, I mean, please go ahead. Go ahead. But my priorities, yeah, but I, okay. I, I, I really care about my priorities okay. for both me and the, my partner, my future partner. Okay, number three. Um, so God fearing, then mtu kujituma. Just be very clean. Three. Be very clean. Ah, but it's called Dani. My man, my man needs to be very clean. Smells good. Uh, yeah, okay. I think that is just the vanity one. But yes, you have to smell good. You have to of be clean. Of course, you have to be clean. Eh, so not everyone, bro. I'm saying, yeah, people know, but eh, but even some shorties. Yeah, like let's mm, keep cleanliness yeah. there. Yeah, clean. I, I try. It's next to godliness. Yes. There we go. Point three yeah, goes to point yeah, yeah, number yeah, yeah, one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Then at least be a little good looking. A little good looking. Yeah. Okay, but to Dani. A little good looking, yeah, baby. Just, but just to have the little looks. I, d I, I don't believe in. Do we cast in your show? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, I don't believe in cover the face and fuck the base. I want to look at something and really feel like. You only say fire the base. I know. That's okay. <laughs> so you said we can cast. Yeah, but I didn't. Say oh, like that. sorry. But it's okay. <laughs> Gosh, sorry. But yeah, it's so fine. give me something it's to okay. work with, yeah? Okay. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> or something you can look at. Yeah. Something kissable. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Okay. See, that kiss. is dangerous, by the yeah. way. I'm, I'm dangerous with that. With, uh, dangerous with kissing? Yes. That mm. that can really make me not... Yeah. Okay. I'm, I'm, I'm bad when it comes to that. Give me something. That can me. really mess me up, right? Like, you like kissing, but you don't like kissing? I love it. Oh, you love kissing? Yes. Okay. So it can... Re it can mislead me. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Are you thinking what I'm thinking? <laughs> <laughs> Do you think? <laughs> <laughs> no, oh my God! Like you don't like it? No, I love kissing. Me ni mwambia tu bado tuko ndani. I might come out of here with a husband. <sighs> okay. <laughs> no, yeah. I, so you really have to be a very good kisser. This is my year. Okay. Mwaka uni mwaka wangu hu. Piera, I'm really trying to focus on this interview. Mwaka kufos. Yo, isi yata kufos. Ii mejileta peke yake. I'm really trying to... To focus on the interview, like, you know, you don't have to talk about it. It's like you have to say, oh, oh, bina kazi yake ni kuflat na my guests. Guys, you've seen, I'm really trying. Yes, I'm Maybe trying. Maybe I'm done flirting with you. That's what I'm telling you. I'm trying. Like my points are the same as in Zinani. Zinani. Zigida. What tribe are you, by the way? I'm Luo, baby. That's what's up. There you go. I told you. Like, Do you mind me flirting with you? Come on. Single father of four. <laughs> Young, sexy, rich. I'm not wealthy, but I'm rich. Hard working, self driven. Umasewa, good looking kidogo. <laughs> good looking kidogo. An amazing kisser. <laughs> I mean, we, we have to confirm that, but basically, you're oh, okay. something like Obina. Okay, something, something like, like 
Good. Yeah. But why are you looking for something like me and I'm here? Like, why are you going to China to create... Okay, it's fine. Or oh, are you something <laughs> like this and you have... Okay, moving on. <laughs> it's because you've never hit on me, probably. You've never tried. Okay, Maybe I thought about tried. it, but I ran away. You should have tried, probably. Now it would have been seven kids. You want more kids? Of course. What do you mean? How many? I don't know. When I get... I'm 42 now. I don't know how many I can get. But if I get that right man, brah. <laughs> what I mean, like, will be like... Applause, applause. Yeah. yeah, yeah, I get it. Like, guys will be... Yeah. When, when is menopause? I don't know nowadays. It starts from 35, so maybe I am. 35. If you go to your firstborn at 35, how 36. does menopause start at 35? It, it's it, different people. So I don't know where mine lies, but somebody got a baby at 50 the other day. Because I'm thinking, if you're 42 now mm. and you want more kids, mm. you know we are racing so against likely. time. Yeah. And I get what you... I, I get you. I get you. <laughs> Get you. you guys didn't see what I was you game. Game. Your game? Ah, good. We got do, you have, do you believe in adoption? Yes, I do. I have adopted a few kids really? from the orphanage, but they stay there. Uh. But I take care of them from their pay so their school fees. So I want to fees. adopt one. Home, That's fine. Stay with. That's fine. Yeah. So there's a, about a month or so ago, on my kids' YouTube channel, they were telling me we need to adopt a child because my daughters want another boy. Me too. Yeah. So they were telling me that, and in the comments... Guys are like, Obina sema tu kweli, ni mutu mepea mima maali. Unataka kuleta, useno me adopt. In the name of that. Yeah. Would you adopt though? Yes, I would. Yeah. I thought about it even last December, yeah. when another orphanage we go to every December with my kids. There's a child we saw and I loved her. Oh. She was amazing. She was dancing and she was happy and she was amazing. And I told my kids, so there was a problem because the girls uh, wanted her. But my son wants a brother. Uh. So we are stuck there. Then now the girls, there was another girl. Ada wanted another boy that she had carried. Brianna and Lola wanted the girl that was dancing. My son wanted another boy. So we are stuck between three other kids. So bad of 50 50. Yeah, Nini, I can give you a boy. What? Anyway, what? Bina, I'm sorry. <laughs> okay, I'm sorry. Let's carry on the Why you but yes. No, no, no. Let's, let's do Don't that. Don't apologize. Yeah. It's fine. Whoever does not like it can stop watching this interview. We continue. It's Obina show live. It's yeah, Obina right here. I'll be trending here. signs and I'll be trending signs and I'll be And what's the problem with that? By the way, can you cut your guy? Yeah. Yeah. Can you see a guy and go like, what's up? What's up, bro? What's no, 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 no. So we have this click with my girls. So if, in case I like somebody, someone will go like, hi, my friend likes you. Like that. Wingman. Yeah, but I wouldn't go and say, hi, I like you. Bro, what if he tells me no? Men get that all no. the time. Did yeah, we die? Because you're men. Did we die? That's why, that's why I think you guys are just like gods. You're amazing. We're gods? Me, if somebody tells me no, that's it. Piera, why I'm are finished. you single? You're saying the right things. Yeah. Like like when, yeah What's yeah, wrong true. with you people? You can cook, you can submit, you feel like the man is this and this and this. You're calling men gods and... But that's true. You have the body, the looks and... You are the right age. You know when I say my life begins at 40? Like, hey, you have no idea. I love what you 40 have no idea. Na moto flani. Ask me. Ah, Iko. Why do you think I've been flirting with you throughout? What time is it? <laughs> you know, I'm kidding. I'm, I'm joking. I'm joking, yeah. But yeah, 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 yeah. No, like, kukatia, sidani na zakatia mtu. But yeah, I can tumana. And then, you know, when, when they're like, I'm like, hi, yeah, it's me. In case it turns the other way, I'm like, like, oh, shit, yeah, why did I? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, yeah. Uh, yeah. I've been rejected a couple of times, of course. Who's that nigga? When did I, was this tried? Good thing. Yeah. Anyway, I don't know. But yeah, I have. I've been rejected before. I've sent someone. And then the guy is like, is like, oh, just say hi. I was like, just say hi. Okay. I think we we'll to a SDA. I call loyal. No. But you know, you know one thing, Obina, me, I'm, a just, I'm a girl next door. Like, I don't think I'm all that at drop dead. You know, you, there's some Nairobi chicks who just look at you like, hey, anyway, who are you? If you holla, definitely this, is, this guy is going to bow. But yeah, I'm like, that one you can look and you're like, okay, no, no thanks. It's just normal. But yeah, I don't holla. I don't like that. So let me read to you, in a scale of 1 to 10, mm. <laughs> let me not say this word because it's what people will use. I'm a, I just say it. Just say for now, we see. Bangability. Uh-huh. One. 
<laughs> Wacha ni kucheka niko very serious. In a scale of 1 to 10, yeah. you're 9.5. That's what you think? It's what I know. To most people. You know why? There's this 5.5 5 that remains. Some people will say, no, she's 42. Some people say, no, she has a child. We have people who have those Fair ones. Fair enough. No, she doesn't have like very big bosoms. There are people who say that. These there are, are people who added. prefer. Then there are also people who like petite. True. So we yeah, so someone will say, no, 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 she's too big hmm. for me. Hmm. You know, but majority of men, you are 9.5. Really? Yeah. Do you know the last time I got laid? The problem now comes to that. Okay. Normally, if you get a shorty who's 9.5, most men will stay away because they come with drama and a lot of baggage. Like, now that we've spoken, I'm thinking you might be pretending because now the deal is too good to be true. Because most shorties who are like you, the drama, the ashawability, therefore the streets. Like, you just look at them and like, eh, hey, who are you? You are going to go to Mm. So they will fear because of that. Mm -hmm. Ama huyu ni reject. Mm. So there's also that on the men she side. Has men, yeah? She has many men, yeah. She has many men either. So because either you have many men, mm. so I could attack you. Two, you are baggage. Mm -hmm. The men I'm saying too high. Oh, you know iPhone 14 Pro Max. Many, 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 many. It's like, hey, we only bill. So I talk about you. Number three, I talk about you because I'm saying you competition. Sure. Sami nifike, then kuna chali yake, kuna sponyo, uyu probably ya kuna sponyo. Mm. Then kuna chali yake, then kuna ule mse wake wa Kenya Power, kuna mtu wa Stima. Kuna mtu wake wa Stima, then kuna BFF, then kuna the trophy boyfriend, wale new post, wale, oh my god, my boyfriend, lakini we all know there's another. Yeah, right. So there's okay. too much, so men will stay away because of mm. that. Ama wote ataka kumpost, na nataka mambo ya chini ya. Mm. Ama... You're looking for a father for your child. Hmm. Ama, umeishiwa na momentum kwa soko, sasa unatafuta last minute umutu taangukia. Unajua nasemanga mkisha fikeji vila ni wangukia mutu, puu, umeoa wanasema, at least ume, umepata mutu. Sasa ni ile. So men will run away because of those True. reasons. Not because you're not hot. And the same thing happens to men. Hmm. There's a time I was single for about a year. I think last year. And my team, my manager, that's my manager, and my PA, hmm. we used to sit down sometimes, we were talking, and I'm telling my manager, when you drive from it, can, can you just believe so we're having a conversation in the car? Do you believe that I'm single? Like, what? So I was like, hey, nobody would believe, nobody. And I would say yeah. it, and people think I'm joking because you're a comedian. Like, oh, no, it's a lie, it's a lie, it's a lie. And I was serious. Now, the problem I did, I was seriously looking for a girlfriend. And when you're looking for a girlfriend, hmm. you never find a girlfriend. Sure. Because I'm like, yeah, 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 because I was really trying to replace my ex. So I was like, okay, I need to find someone. So the quality, she has to look like her, she has to be da 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 And then you find someone, you sit down like this over a cup of coffee, you're like, ah, oh, shit. <laughs> she just has a conversation, you're like, ay, 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 ay. No, 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 no. Then you don't call again. Then you meet another one over a drink like this, you mm -hmm. listen to what they say, you, the way they be, eh, this one is too ratchet. Eh, this one is too immature. This one is too childish. Eh, this one wants attention. Mm. This one cannot. You start, then you find. So that's what happens. So most men as well, mm. high value men, not just men. Most high value men don't have the women they are looking for. You'll find women. Mm. Even you can find men. Mm. Men are everywhere. Women are everywhere. But the one you're looking for, you might not find because of the level that you put. You want a woman who is self-driven, who does this, who does that. Mr. Kideman and Nick Pigia Kunitisha data. However, I can buy you data. Mm. You're on post pay. During the end month, you'll just find I've already paid for mm. you a post pay, uh, maybe it's 5Gs or something. Yeah. I can do it because mm. I want to. Mm. But, babe, Nini, uh, Unatuya, please call me. I'm like, what? Nakutumia credit? Auni pigiangi, but Munatumia, please call me. Then, why are you calling? I don't want a chick when you're not going to blog. I can comment to you. I can comment to I can comment to you. Ama kwa Nairobi gossip, mm. akuko, nini, ati, they we don't care button. Nini, so, you see, so I there's know. those ones. I, I don't want a chick that when I show up, because I meet very powerful individuals. Today mm. you've seen the people interviewing yeah. here. Mm. I come here with her, she's seated here, then someone shows up here. and she, She's <sighs> just funning out. She's already, oh my God. Nini, nini. Niki and I kwa cho, msia shampati hivi namba, mesha andika, kesho imepigwa. Then I show up, we may catch in my boys. You know, boys talk. Yeah. That's the worst thing. That's exactly. the disrespect. Exactly. That's disrespect. Yeah. Because I'd rather just tell me and I'm like, okay, now let me let you go. Yeah. Other than 
because men also want to have a woman who is impenetrable. Mm. The Great Wall of China. Mm. <laughs> I want to know people want you. Yeah. I want to know. Baby, na job beshtia ko na I'm like, oh really? I'm like, oh that's interesting. Yeah. And I say, maji ame DM. Hey, what can him reply? Me no, me no chat na I'm like, yeah, ni 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 ni. Men love that. But since I go na DM, I uko sure. Akizima simu kuna wazi, kwa wai, goi, 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 ni mteja, wo, lo, 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 lo. Mi anda shore that tells me, babe, I'm going for a girl's night out. She will come tomorrow yeah. or the next day. She goes to Maldives, goes to South Africa, whatever. And you're but I know mm -hmm. she is. Now, finding those ones is very hard. Because the ones you'll find like that are already independent. Yeah. And independent women don't listen to men. Most of them. Yeah. Not Let's all. See most of them. Most of them. And independent men want women who can submit. So there's a disconnect. We want women dia kosawa na ngangana na taka mwana mke mwenye rambia, babe, I'm hungry, can you make that uh, amazing food? Na kwambia, sawa. Lakini we mwana mke umepata, ni wana kwambia, ay, babe, mimi nimechoka, mi sezi pika chapo leo. Mimi nimechoka job sa hii. Mimi nimechoka, mi sezi pika chapo leo. No, no, there's a, there are ways to say, hmm. bazile, ay, mimi nikupikie. <laughs> Auntie, <laughs> a man wants a woman who cook for her. But to me, them, she's empowered and everything. She's independent, yeah. and I'm the auntie who pick and I cook. Serve. Una kula food po andi yola kini ni auntie. Yeah. Una mukasbui. Do you really think men don't know which socks to wear? Before oh, you, they, they are wearing. They do. However, when the woman gives it to you, it's nicer. Babe, which which tie? Which which tie? Okay. A guy who can run an organization. Hmm. A guy who can drive a car and text at the same time. Yeah. You think I not pick socks? I'm an underwear. I'm 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 not talking about really yellow. I'm a yellow. <laughs> I'm a wake up. I'm be ah babe shuali. Babe see why you are yellow. Babe why you are ugly? Makes them feel. They are. It's called extending uh, a, a lifeline. They know. This is me just like. Really? No, but now you know men cannot communicate such yeah. things because you are a man, so you're yeah. supposed to be a man. Anyway, so that's I, a I think I think so. Yeah, I I feel where you're coming from, and you know when you said um, about people having this particular notion about a person, like for example, I'm a DJ. Yeah. You know, any person will be like. Yep. She live for the streets. Yeah, she's in the club. Yep. And that, that only scares men. You know, they think, and if she's a DJ. Yeah. Mm, of which I wanted to ask you, uh, you DJ, you do these club events and everything, and you are among, actually I think you are the first female DJ yeah, that came out and then it, yeah. now there's a couple of them. But while when you trailblazers, you are among mm. them. Most, the notion is that most women, they sleep for their jobs, mm -hmm. especially in the showbiz space. I've seen a couple of people who will tell some showbiz, for me to give you this job, you have to give up the, the cookie. That happens? Yeah. For you, have you been there? Did you give up the cookie? Did you miss the job? What happened? And how did you make it to be this big? That's because I didn't give out the cookie. That's why I'm big. Oh. The moment you give out, you're, you're finished. Oh. You are finished. And that's why I keep telling other female DJs, the moment you go that route, you're done. I'm a party manager of club and I'm a gig every Wednesday. I'm a party leo, Kesho, Kesho Kutua, and I find a DJ will come. I'm party here. I'm party here Wednesday bando. So don't ever work with your, with your body. And you see, for us female DJs, to be honest, it's a, it's more of the people want to see you. You know, it's not about so much about the music that you play. True. People just want to look at the DJ. Let's see who's there. You know, and all that. So even you party yourself in the club. Like, if I tell you my experiences in a club, you 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 won't believe me. I've I've even been brought a car in the club, brand new. You know, like I've had, I've had crazy experiences, to be honest. You're there, you're playing, you see bounces just come in there like, unaito. And you're like, ah, siendi, you know? Uki ambwani nani anakuita and how, you're like, okay. <laughs> you're like, this is where my poverty ends. Yes. But you're like, you know what? No, I'm working right now. Maybe I can see you after, you know? You can go say hi and whatever as long as you know what you're doing. But what I'm going to Moja, and I've said it again, I think I said it on some channel. I said, if there is a man who has ever done me a favor, you know, basically taken my cookie for them to give, let him stand up. That is something 
no one will ever do. I have never compromised myself and I will never because of money. And that's why when I was telling you earlier, I'm very content. I want to live in Runda, yes, I really want to. But will I compromise myself because I want to live in Runda? I, I want G-Wagon, right? And I find a man who wants to get it for me. So I sleep with him today so he can get me the G-Wagon, right? And I get the G-Wagon. Sai, ni melala usiku, asubuni amke napata G-Wagon. And then? You drive it. And then? Alafu, ni kuwapo tu niko hivi. Niko hivi, sindio? I didn't work for it. You worked. Exactly. You How worked. did I do it? Mean? Am it's I proud of right. myself? Depends if you enjoyed. I don't. <laughs> but you know <laughs> what I mean? Like, yeah, 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 I'm, I'm yeah, so happy yeah. to have the little, and if the big come, as long as I, I haven't compromised myself. So, unaubangwa mara mingi. Aye. Unipesa hini kupati hii deal sa hizi ndio hii deal. They don't come like that. Kwanza unaizaitu watu nambu ebu kam. There's this meeting, a book come for this meeting. You go for that meeting, you just look, you're like, okay, I know where this is at. After 30 minutes, you're like, I know there's no yeah, show Yeah, you know, even the show might be there. Me, oh. I've gone to places where even they did not negotiate my, my, nini, my pay. Not once, not twice. They don't even negotiate. They're like, cool. Come, 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 let's have a drink. I'm like, I don't drink. But also sometimes you have to be nice. You know, you can't just look at somebody and go like, I'm off. No, you don't it's, want it's, to, it's kind, taki to kucho, be kind. It's very you just important sit to be there kind. and you're like, hey, the next thing on an easy conversation is when you end. So it's up to you to decide, do I need this job? Let me tell you something. Obina, I have lost a deal. Until today, I remember that deal. I feel like crying. Okay. It's huge. I sent that deal in Dubai. That's how big that deal was. And my contract, when I was given that deal, meeting Nini Nini, I was put up in one of the best hotels in in um, Dubai when I was going to for that meeting. Like, it was amazing. Yani from being picked to the airport, I even had a concert for John Legend, first class, seated in Bele. The, some, yani the things that were part of that package. Anyway, the contract after it was brought, it was like... Fine print. Decide. And they're not even mincing their words. They, kwani olikuwa tuangapi? Maybe it was they then. It was but you know, work. somebody said, no, <laughs> in the meeting it was team, but now the main guy is like, make up your mind, decide if you, you know. And what are you going to Miss Rika, you can man to go but of course he, Alison, he wanted me to be there. He wanted to. To be your to man. Yeah. And I've seen also, uh, you are a very good mother. You are a present mother. How I'm is that coming about along? Cars. Oh, yeah, kwa gari, tuko kwa watoto. <laughs> How is parenting and to celeb like bringing you? First of all, does your daughter know you are a star? Mm, yes and no. Yeah, okay. she knows. She, she, knows she kind of has DJ. an idea. Or she DJ, knows you are a DJ. Yeah. She doesn't know. Maybe when we go outside somewhere and people say hi and whatever. She's like, like, you're famous. Like you. You're famous. Oh. But now nowadays, she's more famous than me. Oh, wow. Yeah. Even Kwanza, many people are always like, oh no, we don't love you anymore. We love your daughter. I was like, yeah. Whatever. Gang, gang. You know? Uh -huh. But of course, they're joking. But yeah, people love my baby more than me now. Yeah, okay. Hmm. Parenting has never been it's easy. Not, it's not been easy. And I tell people, the other day I was trending because I said, because guys were like, oh, you know, Piara, sue your baby daddy, go to court and whatever. Ah. You know, yet, first and foremost, they were directing to the wrong baby daddy. I don't know why people think. They, they associate me with, uh, I'm, I'm sorry, I have to say it here, with Jomo. Because I saw it the other day, and maybe this is something I really need to address. Jomo is not my baby daddy. He's not. Because guys were raising that, it was trending because of... Which Jomo? The Mtoto wa nani? Uhuru? Cousin, no, Jomo. No, guy. Oh! Nani Kiguta? I don't know, she I went to court or something, yeah, okay. and then now people start telling me. You know, that hashtag, or go to okay. court or whatever, even me to go to court. I'm like, see you, yeah, yeah. See, it has never been but him. There was something. No, never. He's, he's, he dates my very good friend. Okay. You know, like we don't, we don't, we don't even meet. Like okay. it can never be him. Okay. You know what I mean? So it's wrong target. Very, very wrong. But Any the other baby dad is present. Present in my baby's life. Hmm. No, like I'm gonna take no. charge of um, Nini. Could have been here. No. Who's the daddy? I've never, <laughs> I've never spoken about my baby daddy. 
Oh. Reason being, I feel like it's it's a phase that we left. Okay. Is not part of our. Of the baby knows him though. Yeah. Let me tell you something I will never do. Okay. I will never say anything negative about my baby daddy to my child. I will never. Why are you single again? Because today I just did the challenge which I'm gonna post tomorrow. Probably you guys will see it like yesterday when this interview is today. I did a challenge and I said, okay. I'm a baby daddy in Kenya. Of course my children have been told negative things about you. Are you serious? Yes. And if you're a baby daddy in Kenya, of course you will battle to be in your child's life. And when you cannot have access, your child will be told, Baba kwa mekutupa na kupendi na mekukana. That's not true. It happens to baby daddies in Kenya. Really? So, you, you are different baby mama. So I'm like... I'm actually quite different. You know why? I even tried to reconnect them. To connect oh. my baby daddy and... And my, ch and my child. You know why? Reason actually was because I realized my baby is going through a lot in school. Oh. You know when other kids go like, so who's your daddy? Where's your daddy? I don't see. I made okay. the effort and reached out to the baby daddy and I was like, you know what? I think you, sh you should have a connection with your child. Like, try this. I am not in the picture. It's that relationship between you two. And he tried. It just didn't work. I think he's just not there yet. So that's... I think when... when so from baby daddy's perspective, mm -hmm. this is what I would say. If you are a baby daddy and you try to connect to your child later in life, mm -hmm. it is hard than when you start early. So the sooner you start, yeah. the better. Yeah. If you start with the child when they are younger, mm -hmm. it will be better. Because when kids get older, they start wondering, where were you? Exactly. Then, so what do you like doing? Mm -hmm. Nini, those know. questions you should not, like you should just know if you are present in their life. And then also, you know the worst thing when you have your child, yeah. now coming from the, a woman's perspective, you've really tried to, you know, nurture your child, yeah. and then this man comes in the picture, do you know the child really gets confused? Because that yep. time when I tried to reconnect them, I realized my child is getting so confused. Like she's so confused about, okay, why is he, why is he not here? Why is he not living with us? What's happened? What, he doesn't like me, you know? Yep. Why is, and I was like, no, that's not good for my baby. So I, I, I just cut it off and I was like, in future, when they are ready to reconnect, they will reconnect. But I will never say anything bad about him. I want my baby to know that the, the dad is a very good person. Don't and he dad. loves dad. The dad. The dad. Is the father. Dad. Okay. okay, say the dad. father. He's a very good. He's a very good person. Okay. He just probably went through a very hard time that he wasn't there at that moment. But Kwani, what will it cost me? Okay. You know, and I want my baby to know that she's loved. So for me to go and say, oh, no, this guy is like this, this guy, oh, come on. It's never that serious. Okay. You no. Know? And that's the same thing I said about taking a man to court. I wouldn't take a man to court so he can give me money. Like, what the fuck? <laughs> you know what I mean? Like, I, if I had a chance, I would take a man to court to love his child. Oh. You know what I mean? Yeah, but not to ask for money at the... Wait, what if, God forbid, that man died and get up, sat and get up his oppressor? I would never de be dependent on a man. Yeah? <laughs> oh, wow. You know, and then the moment you realize the man is not in the picture, you work hard. You, That's true. You're like, okay, it's just me and this baby and I need the best for the baby. So you really, really work hard. So you're not a bitter baby mama? Yeah. Okay, I'm going to say, I'm supposed to get a baby. I'm supposed to get a baby. Even if, nice, let me tell you, if you met with my baby daddy, I think you know my baby daddy, and I think you've met us. To keep at an Ivy, let me tell you, I say hi with them. Like, we are, we are, you'd think we are very good friends. Don't be a baby daddy. Omji! Can you be a baby daddy? Nobody knows my baby daddy. So, to be a helper for us to break internet in oh. three, two, go. No, it wouldn't be good for him. Okay. Because yeah. ah, yeah. he's married. Okay. He was Tua married. Ah. Oh, wait. <laughs> <laughs> no, 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 no. He got married after I got the baby. Does that make sense? So he has a family. It's your story to tell. No, 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 no. I did not date baby a married daddy. man. Listen, I I am not part of this. I don't know you. <laughs> Omina, I did not date a married man, okay? Yeah. I did not. He was not married when we were together. And when we got a baby, he was still not married. Then we got a baby. He met another woman and they got married. And they are happy. But so why didn't he marry you? So maybe we ask him. Is there a sudden number? Now they are saying rumors hmm. on the ground hmm. 
that wewe ni LGBTQ. Number, what? That is why you and your baby daddy never worked and that's why until now you've never been married that you prefer them ladies than the banana. You don't like the banana, you like shorties or you like like liking. You like the girls. Oh, silence. Oh, all of a sudden now you can keep quiet. Okay. Silence no, just, speaks just volumes. Thinking. Like where did that come from? See, you're in the room, and I said, like them shorties. You always hang out with shorties, hot shorties. Curiosity, do you think I'm a fair mama? Huh? I'm on the stud. Anyway. <laughs> <laughs> My girl got a girlfriend. Anyway, you know what? I, I can't even talk about that. But do you like girls? Like, do you think girls are cute? Ah, yeah. You have your answers, <laughs> ladies and gentlemen. What kind of a question is that, though? But we've been talking about everything. We've talking. We've talked about baby daddy, about everything. Now we can't talk about your preference. Okay, are you straight? Okay, why are you gay? <laughs> <laughs> okay, let me tell you. Uh, I'm not straight. I'm quite curvy. Ah. Quite, I'm a very. Okay. Aya, now. <laughs> <laughs> Moving on. Now, Twende International Kidogo. Your international tours, I've seen you posted like a few things there. Kwani Bilia Dubai. Ivana Tena. Ah, No, 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 no. Uh, pack no. and Chill is back. I know, man, uh -huh. man. I love that product. Pack and Chill. I am so glad now we've gotten back together with my ex. That's Carnival. Eh. So, yeah. <laughs> So yeah, we are bringing it back bigger and better. Okay. You know, you know. Let me tell you something about pack and chill. Pack and chill is for very specific people. Okay. You know those guys who just don't like going to the clubs every now and then and whatever. That's so me. we have, yeah. You just come in your car, chill with your girlfriend, chill, do your business, whatever. You know, like the many times I did not get in my car and work on proposals. Like I love pack and chill. That's just me. Okay. If I was not a DJ, I would never be in a club. I'll be just pack and chill. You and I both. You know? So yeah, pack and chill is coming back. Um, I have my international tour. I'm doing Australia. The ones that are confirmed so far, it's Australia. I haven't, it will be the first time in Australia. Uh, I'm doing six cities. Then I have um, Dubai, obviously. We have Qatar coming and Netwaji. Uh, yeah, let me see how. Okay, yes, there's the US, obviously. Okay. Uh, there's a name. I, 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 Pierre, I, I, it, I mean, me. Gani? Pierre Mejua. Yes, there's the US. There is uh, in it, what is it? It's Nini. Uh, EU. Kai. Oman. Kai. Oman. 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 Yes, Oman. Yes, I have Oman. Oh, <laughs> man. So I have Ethiopia. Like, so there are many, many that are coming. Okay. And I'm so excited about that because I feel like when I'm now I'm celebrating 15 years as a DJ. So You've been it's for 15 years. Yes. Yo. I know. That's some time. So it's a big thing for me. It's uh I mean teaching has been feeding me. So um, DJing is the only thing you do. At the moment, yes. I actually quit my day job. You had a day job. Yes, for the longest time. Come I've, on. I've been working at Scanad. I worked at Scanad for the longest time. I know. I know. I know. I don't do corporate, yeah? yeah. You know a DJ here? Yeah. No, I actually before I became a DJ, I used to I used to be in advertising here. Yeah? I was um was in production first, so all these commercials you see we used to okay. I worked at one FM and then I came back again to Scanad. That time uh, I, I went to Ogilvy. That time I was doing brand um, it's called brand assets. Okay. Especially for my biggest client was Airtel, so I used to handle like 16, 17 markets. Like, it's a big thing. I, I love corporate. It taught me so much, like so, so much. And that's why I feel like sometimes it's easy for me to deal with my brands because there's so much I understand when it comes to advertising. So, yeah, I've been in corporate for a while. I worked for, there's a company, I don't know if you know it, Kitambo San, it used to be called Utna. Yeah. Utna? Yeah, anyway. So, yeah, I used to work there. I've worked in Citizen. I've worked in Nation. I've worked... Uh, mm. Mm. Yeah. Yeah. Well, mm. you exactly. have through it. I have worked. I think the corporate side of you is now how you're managing your pack and chill and your event side. Yes. Because I came to your pack and chill was in was in Akuro Naivasha, the Safari Rally yeah. one. 
you made us drive all the way from Nairobi. Kuli kuana traffic. So we got there. I don't know if you remember me saying hi. Mm -hmm. I think I also got on stage. I'm shading, yeah. Yeah, I got on stage. Kidogo hype, kidogo. Mm -hmm. But uh, that day, I think you're wearing a military jacket. I think so. Yeah, yeah, they like kanini. Yes. Mm -hmm. And then you are. You are all over, like I understood because even when I said hi to you, you didn't say hi to me the way like you normally say you. hi. Mm -hmm. No, you said hi to me like you know me, but you had a lot in your head. I know events are quite ta yeah. uh, tasking, but it was packed like we didn't have a place to park our car. To we came, yeah. took a time, took a time, took a panda stage, kidogo, kelele. Then we yeah. went looking for food, food, liko, meisha. Tulishwa na kila kitu. Food, it was drinks, crazy. Aya. And you know, guys had their own drinks, but yes. we still had our bar. Mas, and we still had Imagine. That time was you made money. Park and Chill was just amazing. I, I I loved I loved the whole concept. You remember it started during COVID, yeah? Yeah. So people love that whole thing. So yeah, we're bringing it back. There's a whole lot of other things that I'm doing. Okay. You will be you you'll be so super proud of me. I'm telling you. You'll be very proud of me. Very I'll be soon. right there with you, baby. Yeah. Yes. There are there are contracts I've signed that I can't wait for people to see and to, to be part of. When you know about them, you'll just be happy for me. You know where I've come from, Obina. Like I've hustled big time and some of the things are coming to life now. From okay. 10 years, 15 years, we are getting that now. So I'm excited to share with my fans and giving content for my haters to hate on. <laughs> you have haters? Hi, bro. Okay. Wana chukia nini? Jueni mrembo? Let me tell you, eh. anything, the haters, you know, there's something somebody said about haters. Eh? Haters are never doing better than you. Yeah, that's you know true. That, that's yeah? true. So... What we are doing is that we are not going to be able to do perfect. Age, they will look for something negative to say. Reason is because they just want to put you down. They don't see why you are the one achieving that. Why is she the one getting lucky? Why is she? They are just bitter people. They're just bad people. You know? And it can be as good person as you. In a ni mimi. But I'm so jealous of your success. Umeandika kitu hivi too, and I come with my. Trudeau. Yeah, and I'm like, oh, Obina Sijui, nini, 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 nini. Guys, people are like you know that. what Human I'm doing like that. this year. I've decided to reduce my engagement with such people because Kitambo, I used to, I want to school you. Yeah. Because I'm just feeling. You post something, someone has not even watched it. You mm -hmm. post something for ten minutes. Yeah. You posted it two seconds later. Hata ibambi. Uh, <laughs> this thing is ten minutes. So you want to write? You've not even watched the thing. Right. I'm on my post kitu. Nirefu sana. Uh, to summarize it, we don't have time. It's just like, read. It will help you. Yeah. So I decided this year, I'm just blocking. Me, I see any negative right. comment. Any. I'm not even engaging. Mm. Highlight, block, report, delete comment. Life that's, goes that's on. That's the same thing I, I do. I just don't want that I negative energy with me yeah. this year. And then also just know that these people, they're coming from a very bad, bad place. Someone who's like that is not a good person. Kabisa. They are just looking for a reason to put you down. So you don't need those people as your followers. And That's if true. somebody, Obina, honestly, somebody really likes you and wants good for you and you've done something wrong, they will come to your DM. Yes. Or most likely they're your friends, so they have your number. They will tell you. But if you want to make a bad negative comment on your comments for other people to see, that is not a, that's not a good person. Me, I've had people and I've done something and they, they come on my DM and they're like, hey, Pera, do you think Kidogo. that one I... Eh? Yeah. I answer it very quickly. You have a nicer yeah, way to approach. Yeah, and I'm like, thank you for, th thanks for telling me that. I appreciate. But if you write it on my comments, the first thing I'm always like, you know what, fuck off. Because they want the attention. You know, people like the attention they get when talking about you. Yeah. That's what haters yes. get. Yeah. Because they'll come, they'll hate, then you'll see other people with similar mics. They like that comment mm -hmm. or they'll comment yeah. beneath it. So this is what I'll say. For anybody who has anything negative that you want to tell me or anything that, any opinion you have about my life, if you have my number, call me. Mm. And if you have my number, trust me, you know how I relate with people. So you'll find a nice way of telling me mm. whatever idea you have. And if you don't have my number, exactly. Yeah. That's it. Exactly. That's it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Anywho, watu wanasukiria weni mtoto wa getikali, umezaliwa kwa pesa, na umelelewa kwa pesa. Ni ukweli? Mimi. Yeah. Umetaseka kweli? Hey, bro. Umeifungi wa nyumpa piera? Ay, we. Umeifungi lana kwa bedsita wewe? That's why I started. Me, I used to cry in South B. Uliza to South B. Who umeanzia South B? Sasa wewe unasema nini? Guys, really? In, yani umeanzia maisha in South B? In a small city. Watu wa majengo wanaongea hapa. Watu wa South B pia. Come on. Let me tell you something, yeah? My parents, my parents really hustled for me, for us. Okay. Okay. My grandparents were, 
well off. Not I can't say we are well off. I can't say we are rich. That's what you people say. Yeah. No, 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 yeah. no. But okay, will you saw me up in nursery? In Meru. Primary? Meru. High school Meru. What was the primary school name? Bishop Imati Bodi. <laughs> High school name? Chogoria Girls. By the madam, you are going to be when I was in high school. <laughs> but I took one as a fee. Yes, she literally quite another useless school. I know, so. No, 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 no. Yeah. But let me tell you something. Do you know I left? I left uh, from four, and worked at KBC immediately. That's when KBC picked me up. Immediately when I was when I was doing my last then paper. Then what you are saying? your last paper na KBC na kungoja. Imagine that is my luck. However, I didn't know Nairobi life. So you can, you can imagine the challenge. Pira. Yeah. I will just Watch a man. To na choma. But ni me fungi wa nyumba, ni me inge, ni me enda kwa matri. Enough times, sin affair. Let me ask you. Ni me kula fries inje. Me kula fries. Which is my fair? Let me tell you, ni fair yangu na kula fries alafu na tembea. Oh, liko na fair. Uka kulia fries. Ni liko na tumi wa fair. Sisi atuna tafia na tayo fries. Data chakula na. Okay. What is your idea of kuta seka tu? Let me ask you this. When you fungi wa nyumba South B, uli la la pia siku. My friends. I used to go to my friends. Walikuwa na ishwapi? Still, so I would be with him. Kwa hostels, nini. Okay. Yeah. It's fine. Guys, if you know, you know. It's fine. I can't it's a No, you are just a seka. But I can't compare myself to, to other people. They are, they are... Kuteseka is different. There's someone who said, Unaiza kuwa shida yako sayi ni 20 bob. Sindio? Na mi shida yangu ni 200 bob. But the feeling is the same. Do you know? It's not true. No, na kuna mzee mwingine hapo shida yake anatafuta 2 million. Mzee okay. amefungiwa nyumba because ana hiyo 2 million. Ako na pesa siju kutoka what loan shark. How much like was the problem is 3k, 3 to 6k. Okay. Thank you for, <laughs> for <laughs> coming to the show. <laughs> okay, honestly speaking, hmm. you've not suffered. So really? to watch it evil. No, sema you've lacked. There's a difference of lacking and suffering. There are nights I went without food. Yeah, because you're watching your weight. Duh. Nah, Different no, thing. no, 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 no. <laughs> Let me tell you something, by the way. A, okay. a true story. And yeah. I went to look for that woman's kumpata. There's a time I didn't have food in my SQ. We used to stay three of us, actually. Three of us in that SQ. We didn't have food. We only had rice. And we really wanted to kanga that rice. At least ikulike. So we went out. We asked the made. There's a kamade wa kiosk alikuapo. If she can give us, waruz. She gave us waruz, you know, because we knew we'd pay another time. Then by the time we tembeyad kufika pale mbele, tunakumbuka atukuamba kitungu. But my pal alikuwa mechukua hivi kitungu. Aliba, si kuchukua. Exactly. Mm. My shock, I couldn't even eat that food. Like I was so stressed out. But yeah, we've, we've, we've been in places Nini, where we didn't even have maskini food. jeuri. Yani muko na <laughs> mchele. Lakini mwenda kuomba waru. Alafu unataka kuomba pia kitu. Kitu. <laughs> Uta trend na hii part. Kwa nini? Nisawa. Nobody. Umesema you have... lacked mwili kwa tuna mchele lakini mnataka mwikarange na waru. Umai kunyo uji na maindi. <laughs> Umejua juisi ya maindi ni nini? Ni uji. Like unakunyo uji ya white I have, and na I maindi. It. Bila sukari. And that's the meal for the day. Like yondo sapa and the whole day meka bila. Umai karanga matawi ya maragwe. Matawi. The way it, it's, it's, it's not even swallowable. No. Jawai. Umai kulu ugali na chumvi. Yeah. Like ugali, hivi, unachukuna, unachinyo kwa chumvi. Yeah. yeah. See for fun. See kama challenge ya TikTok. Like, hiyo ndiyo iko. Let me tell you something about me, eh? Umai lala inge kama watchman. Tukua tumefungi wa gete ya kuingia shule, tukua tumetuka nini. But let me tell you something. I thank God I haven't been probably to the, you know, rock bottom, rock bottom. And that's why I'm very good at helping. Okay. You know, when God gives me something, I always make sure. And I, I have another Muslim friend of mine, Alini Ambia. Let me tell you, Pierre, now that you have, make sure. Enda kwa barabara, piana maziwa, piana mkate, piana unga. Every now and then, and I do that. Because you see, maybe I was lucky to eat rice. Somebody else is not even lucky to have this. So I ensure, one, once in a while, I give out food. Mi kwa barabara neza kwa natembea hivi tu, napata na mtu, ata simjui. Ata miogopa kupigwa, by the way. I'm like, hey, excuse me. You know? 
na mwambia tu imagine my heart tells me to give you this fanya hivi tu nampatia kaka 5000 hivyo ama whatever whatever i have that day barabara gani but you know you know five, that thing. I'm sure you have done it. I am sure <laughs> no, you have no, done no, it. I do. You know you just walk in the street and you look at that this person you're like no I don't know. And also that's because of where I've come from. You know a place of luck. My luck might not be yeah, that yeah, bad. Yeah, yeah, true. But I've lacked some time and I feel like maybe somebody else is lacking like the way I used to. So I try to help a lot. If there's anyone who helps and my baby has learned the same thing. You have the, to teach them. Yeah and the thing the, the worst thing is that my baby now is overdoing it. Tunaweza kuwa tumetoka tumenunua KFC fulani hapo kwa gari tunapita pale you know hapo la view there are many kids my baby gives out all of it and you see the worst things that don't give out our food change the route <laughs> child lock central yeah. lock yadrisha inside but now inside. i still want to teach her the, the needs to share and give and no and teacher that. but you know you cannot pour from an empty cup true Maybe sometimes we just had a lot and maybe that's why she's giving up. Yeah, so can ulia mtoto 18 pizza na ni mtoto mmoja. Alafu kani mtoto mmoja zanga watoto wengi wanaanganga nayo chakula by the time unatoka hivi kwa KFC drive through imeshaisha. Wanaendesha vyo wenyewe. Imeshaisha mpaka wakati zile wanakuangalia zile hizo muta simiangalia simu moja. Simu moja hizo hizo mazinga wings. My baby is giving me that pressure by yeah. way to have another baby so. Don't yeah. worry, I got you covered. Speaking of, hebu tupigie wao mtoto wako kidogo tumsalimie. Nataka nimsalimie pia ajue kidogo mimi ni nini. Yeah, you sure you want to talk to her? We mpigie simu tu msalimie. Mama, may you ask him how many kids he has? <laughs> Talk to him. I I have four kids. Huh? I have four kids. Four. Yes. How old are they? My first born is 13, my second born is 10, my third born is 9, my last born is 6. Love you, mom. Good night. Love you. Good night. Love no, you. no, I'm talking to my children. Wait. <laughs> <laughs> Hi uh, guys, good night. We'll talk later. I'm talking to someone very interesting, my new found friend. So I'll talk to you guys later. Okay, Lola. Hi, <laughs> uh, good night. Good night. Not you. Hi, <laughs> 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 my kids, you are my kids. Hi, let's continue the conversation. So those are the kids I have, okay? Yeah, so 13, 10, 9 and 6. Three girls, one boy. One boy. How yes. old is the boy? My boy is 13. <laughs> <laughs> ah. Eh, why? Mm. Mm? Just feels like asking. Okay. So your mom is single. Yeah. And that's I, true. and I am single. Hmm. Are you thinking what I'm thinking? What am I thinking? I don't know. You don't know what I'm thinking? Yeah. But yeah, I think you have a lot because how did you get children? <laughs> exactly. Okay, does your mom have a husband? No. How did she get you? Because she's a girl. <laughs> oh. Fair enough. See also me my children came with their mother. No, I don't. They are not married. No, 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 no. They are not married. You get? So when no. people are married, that's when you have a wife. I don't get you. We are not married. She's in America. <laughs> Can you explain to me? See, that's what I'm explaining. Like she gave birth to the children and then left me with the children and then she went to America to work and look for okay, money. I'm I am the real father. <laughs> so oh, no, I got you. Yes. Like the way my dad is still. <laughs> <laughs> yes, 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 we've got that part. <laughs> yeah, yeah, you know mama, yeah. You get
I do, you know, you're on speaker, so I do want everybody to hear what we're talking about. Everybody. Where, Mama? <laughs> we have our own <laughs> private lives. Okay. Yeah, everybody. Okay, but Mom. Yeah. Ask him how old he is. Him. How old are you? I'm 33 years old. My mom is older than you. Yes, and what's the problem with that? Oh my God, and the way gay. Huh? Oh my God, for real. Yeah, what's the problem? Uh, uh, uh. You speak old? I speak but old. But you're not old. <laughs> oh, he speaks mature, like he's mature, right? Yeah. Okay, cool. You, you're speaking uh, like a 16-year-old uh, and you're 7. Mom, she's... Mom. Uh-huh. He's younger than Baku. Yeah, he's pretty young. He's quite young. Like, I'm, I'm literally 10 years older than him. Mm. Yeah, so he's like my baby. No, I'm not. I'm like <laughs> your husband. Ah! <laughs> exactly. You think he can be my husband, Mama? Not yet. No? Why, Why not, not yet? You need to find someone good. Who? You need to find someone you love. Someone who I love, right. And someone I love or I'll run away. But what if mom loves me? Mm hmm I have to see you first. Oh, so you are the one who will accept me or reject me? Uh-huh. Who is it that you think you love, that you think is good for me? And I think someone you like. Someone I like? Who do you think I like? No, oh, mom, you already know. <laughs> yeah, you already know. Really? It's about to There's go someone. down. There's someone? Yeah, duh. Yeah, duh. Hey, maybe we should leave this okay. conversation. Okay, watch how we leave this conversation <laughs> here. But when, when do I see you so you can approve me very fast? Because me, I want to get married very fast. I'm not waiting. Tomorrow. <laughs> Allah? Allah. Okay. Yeah, yeah. I'll what, tell what, will, what will make you like him? What will you be looking for? Something. Like what? Something. His looks? If he's tall, if he's he short? Looks. Uh huh. His money? His money? <laughs> His money? Fair enough. Uh -huh. His dressing? His dressing? Mm -hmm. His attitude? His attitude? Uh huh. He's dressed. Are you sure you are seven? <laughs> how about God fearing, Mama? Well, like he needs to know how to pray and stuff. Yeah, and he has to be obedient. Right. Obedient to who? To Mom. Oh, wow. She's older than you. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, Mama, she Sawa, you on set. tomorrow is the deal. I'm seeing you tomorrow. And you're picking me up. I'm picking you up? Yeah. From where? From my school, duh. <laughs> so how am I supposed to know where your school is? Mom will bring you. Okay, so I pick mom. We come with mom to pick you from school. No, mom picks you. Oh, mom will pick me. But I have my car. What, what, which kind of car do you drive? <laughs> it's a German machine. It's a what now? A German machine. A Mercedes? Hey, mommy. Okay. Okay. Because I know that my, the one my mom drives mm. comes with you as. Uh-huh. Okay. Your mom drives a G-Wagon, right? No. <laughs> <laughs> what does your mom drive? <laughs> you drive the little tiny car. Oh. A little tiny car. Okay, so tomorrow I'll pick mom with my but big. She has a bigger one. She has a Nissan. Okay, so we'll come and pick you with mine. Okay. Ah, yeah. See you tomorrow. Good night. Go to bed. Pick me right on time. Okay. I don't want to see the dark side of you, so I'll keep time. What's the time? Three. Three. Okay. By three, we'll be there. I'll be with mom. And I will dress nicely, and I will carry money. <laughs> and tell mom to tell you my dark side. 
You have a dark side. Mommy and I want you. How I do? The way I used to tell you to say sorry. Oh, yeah. It, when I use an, an F word by mistake. Yeah, and when you do the middle finger. I don't do the middle finger. Mom, remember? I did, just did it <laughs> once in traffic. <laughs> It was once. Mom say sorry. I'm sorry again. Bye. I'm sorry again. And I'll never drive here again. <laughs> Aya, good night. Tomorrow is school. We'll pick you tomorrow. Sleep I now. Sure. Sleep now, Mama. Everybody's looking at me, the entire crew. Everyone. Yeah, say good night. Daddy, I'm not. <laughs> Bye. Love you. Love you. Alrighty. Sasa mimi ni kama nimeonekaniwa. <laughs> so tomorrow we are picking baby from school. But then you better do it. No, She's I will. I don't lie to children. Good. I don't. Because I would not be happy if someone lies to my kids. I don't lie to my kids either. I tell them the truth the way it is so that they, if I could not, I would have told us. So I will come through. Because even if me and you don't work out, <laughs> <laughs> she can be a very good friend to my kids. So and I've noticed she wants a brother. Yeah. And my son is very cool. He's very chill. He can be a good big brother. And you see my last-born daughter, Lola? Hmm. And your my last-born Lola speaks like an 18-year-old. Are you serious? You need she to asked me in their channel. Check their channel. She asked me, why are you and mom not together? Did you cheat on mom? <laughs> it's the on their channel. And I told them, people. what do you think? Hmm. They answered themselves the whole episode. They said everything. Go watch it. Oh my God, I'm on it. My nice. five year, that time she was, I think, five. She's the one who started the conversation. She talks like, a, she'll tell me, Dad, me, I don't like Piera. She would. Like, she'll tell me on the I, side, Dad, Piera Kidogo, Akuna Maringo, Nini. We, like, that's but Lola. I, like that. I, I, I don't mind that, imagine. Yeah. Let her be herself. You know, eventually I love she it will. Too. You just need to guide them. But no, I let guide. Them be I teach, I guide. Yeah. Then I let them be let free them and be. speak. Sometimes, you know, we speak about some things on their channel and people go like, you've coached the kids. I'm just like, Actually, I did. do I have time to sit down and start telling my kids, you know, let's say, and the same thing you said about your baby daddy, mm. I'm the same with my baby mamas. Mm. I would never sit down with my kids and start bad mouthing their mothers or okay. tell them, you know, your mother. I'm like, you'll know. find out. And thank God my kids, they see and they know. Yeah. And they share. Yeah, kids are not stupid, by the way. Eh? They see these things. Finally. Hmm. Who's your celebrity crush? Hey, who is that celebrity? <laughs> <laughs> uh, let's like, who are you? Haki Kavi Baya, who you? Baby number two. Hmm. What? Eh. Would there be anyone like that? Yeah. Aye. There are few. See, they give you options. Yeah. Maybe. Options, mm. maybe Kasipu. And it was a little salas. Kasipu na salas. He keep in the How do you even crash on Kasipu and salas? She he. Zandani. Kasipu and salas. Like they are two opposites. Like, okay, kuongea wako same. Kuongea wana peleka na hivi. But more than light skin, more than dark skin, more than pum pum, more than skinny. Let me tell you, I've never met these people. I've never met them though. But I'm no, you know what? No, I'm just kidding. I'm just a fan. They, they, they are exciting to watch on on Instagram. Okay, they are. I like. I watch them. I think they are mm -hmm. very interesting. We joke too, na salasi otaskia tu. Oyo mrembo. Biera kujia dunko niko nye niko peleke mumias east. You know he's a he's a he's an MP for mumias east, mm -hmm. and he's really performing qua ground. Ana chapo kazi. Na kasipu pia kwa streets. Ana fanya mama zindani. Thank you so Who's much for that? coming no, to the show. For having you though. This was fun. I've not had you. I just told you. Sema, thanks for hosting me. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Thanks for hosting Mind your language. Yeah, thanks for hosting me. Yeah. Akile and Saniko, now you're two. Mungo and Saniko. Sema! No, 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 no. no. It's Sema! Okay. It's a free space to edit. Ah! Uh, I've had that before. He's been there, done that, got a baby, you know? So. Ali Sema, to edit. Okay. <laughs> Have a good night. I would, but... Uh, <laughs> you know we have a date tomorrow? Yes, we do. Yeah? Yes, we do. What Let's time are we meeting? Let's see how that goes. We can meet Ali, have lunch, and then go pick yes. them up at three. It's a date, baby! That's cook. what's up. Wow! Nilikuwa nisha pigia sabu ya chakula nikasema ndampeleka wapi? 
Just come home, I'll cook for you. Oh, wow. Just, just bear in mind the baby is not at home. Okay. I think I was still interviewing other. No, I could not have been interview Leo in a funny end in Lale Mapema. Niamuke Mapema Kesho. Thank you. We for can actually go home together. <laughs> Good night. Why do you keep laughing? Like I'm not supposed to say that. Whew. Kuna ice. Eh? Hapa kuna nga esi. Hey, hey. Okay, sit down. Eh? <laughs> okay. I'm not very good with certain things. Um, what, what did I want to say? Stop looking at me. I can see you're looking at me. Yes, thank you. Thank you for coming to the show. You are amazing. Uh, keep doing what you do. You are an amazing mother. You are a talented DJ and a businesswoman. And uh, keep doing that. And we will keep supporting you. And uh, good luck with your tour and, the, and your new relationship with me. Uh, <laughs> and for the fans who are watching, good night. God bless you. I am speechless. <laughs> Have a good night. Let's wow. Go.